Electromagnetic induction heating comes from the electromagnetic induction phenomenon discovered by Faraday. That is, an alternating magnetic field induces current in the conductor, which causes the conductor to heat up. Since the discovery of the heating effect of electric current passing through the wire, there have been many inventors in the world who are engaged in research and manufacture of electric heaters. In 1890, Swedish technicians invented the first induction smelting furnace and slotted core furnace. In 1895, the prototype of an electric iron appeared in the United States. In 1909, the appearance of the electric stove realized the process of converting electrical energy into heat energy. In 1916, the Americans invented a closed cell furnace with a core and electromagnetic induction technology gradually entered the practical state. The principle of electromagnetic induction heating is that the alternating current generated by the induction heating power supply generates an alternating magnetic field through an inductor, i.e. a coil, and a magnetically conductive object is placed in it to cut the alternating magnetic force lines, thereby generating an alternating current, i.e. eddy current, Inside the object, the eddy current causes the atoms inside the object to move randomly at high speed. And the atoms collide and rub against each other to generate heat energy, thereby heating the object. That is, by converting electrical energy into magnetic energy, the heated steel body induces magnetic energy to generate heat. In this way, it fundamentally solves the problem of low efficiency of the electric heating plates. Electric heating coils and other resistive heating methods through heat induction. Induction heating is the use of electromagnetic induction to generate electric currents inside the heated material, and relying on the energy of these eddy currents to achieve the purpose of heating. The basic composition of induction heating system includes induction coil, AC power supply and work pipes, according to different heating objects. The coil can be made in different shapes. The coil is connected to the power supply, and the power supply provides alternating current to the coil. The alternating current flowing through the coil generates an alternating magnetic field passing through the work pipes, which causes the work pipes to generate any currents to heat it. Simply put, it is to generate an alternating current, thereby generating an alternating magnetic field. And then using the alternating magnetic field to generate any currents to achieve the heating effect. Simply put, the principle of electromagnetic induction heating is to use the conversion between electricity, magnetism and heat to achieve the effect of heating the heated object itself. Electromagnetic induction heating technology is mainly used to heat metal materials and graphite. The British physicist Faraday's law of electromagnetic induction tells us that magnetism can generate electricity. Danish natural philosopher Oster's right hand rule, Ampere's rule, tells us electricity can generate magnetism. Regardless of whether it is magnetism generating electricity or electricity generating magnetism, the target object must have good electrical conductivity, magnetic permeability, or both conductive and magnetic properties. Because usually only metal materials can meet the conditions, and only a few substances such as graphite meet the conditions in non-metal materials. Therefore, induction heating technology is mainly used to heat metal materials and graphite. The basis of electromagnetic induction heating technology is the principle of high-frequency electromagnetic induction. Alternating current is rectified into direct current through a rectifier circuit. Then the direct current is converted into a high-frequency high-voltage current with a frequency of Archer. KHZ to KHZ. When the current flows through the coil, alternating current is generated. Variable magnetic field. Strong eddy currents are generated when the magnetic field lines of the magnetic field pass through the metal material, causing the metal material to rapidly heat up by itself. Magnetic road series electromagnetic heater is a set of high performance induction heaters. It introduces a dedicated digital processor from Texas Semiconductor Company and adopts full bridge control technology with industrial grade stability. It is the current front end control technology in the electromagnetic heater field, especially suitable for industrial induction electromagnetic heating. 
which can meet the requirements of long-term uninterrupted operation. Texas Semiconductor is a pioneer in the field of industrial control, with professional software algorithms that can accurately control various states, make the machine components match accurately, and extend the life of the equipment. The electromagnetic induction keeping technology itself is relatively mature technology. However, for a long time, the power of the electromagnetic induction keeping technology has not been greatly improved. Generally, our kilowatts, rarely exceeding two kilowatts, which is difficult to be widely used. After years of tackling heat problems, the scientific and technical personnel of Suzidal Electromagnetic Technology Company Limited have overcome the difficulties of 100 kilowatts of high-frequency and high-power electromagnetic induction heating technology.